and see the wonder in it. Two can gaze together and share that wonder. We are forever emitting sparks of imagination. So, let's spark together. In every mind is a piece of code that operates our creative functions. It forms a conduit called the cerebrumbilical cord that extends to the farthest reaches of imagination. So let's build. Together we can push back the boundaries until they are a mere speck on the stellar horizon. Let's fly. Let's put our minds together and create. Everyone on this orb of dreamers contributes ideas. They ascend the cerebrumbilical cord to congregate in the Imagisphere, the natural home of our creative wanderings. So join us, for you have always been and always will be most welcome in Little Big Planet. Gasp in utter amazement at your pod, your home base of adventure, your window into the wonder plane, your exploratorium for the vastness that is the Imagisphere. We weren't kidding when we said your, so feel free to pull out your poppet and slap a few stickers and decorations around. Make yourself at home, because you are home. Once you're done, why not invite some friends over? Have a party. The neighbours never complain, so go bananas. And when you want to leave, well, just waddle up to your pod computer and press the menu button. Marvellous adventures are just a step outside your door. Well, how marvellous you found your way to the pod computer. The entire Imagisphere is now but a flick of the left stick and a tap of the action button away. Why not stretch your legs by picking the play option? Ah, bunkum. Another shining beacon of wonder planetary wonderment. And you can visit Bunkum any time you like simply by selecting a badge using the left stick and pressing the action button. <laughs> it's almost too simple. When you visit Little Big Planet, you become your true and pure self, a cuddly, excitable adventurer called a sack person. And this is you. What a cracker! Use the left stick to move your sack person. A little tippy-tappy for a shuffle and a somewhat more substantial push for a bound. Take a run and jump, why don't you? You do it by pressing the action button. A quick tap for hippity hop 
and a long press for a lippity leap. Marvelous! Transporting oneself from the earthly plateau to the realm of little big planet is akin to being born again. You emerge here a bundle of naked, woolly innocence. The operative word being naked. Put some clothes on that say, I mean business, buster. Get some gadabout trousers or an adventurer's hat, for example. To do so, bring up your poppet with the menu button and select the Customize Character option. From there, you can peruse its contents with the left stick and don your chosen attire with the action button. Once you are suitably suited and booted, having raided your boutique, a press of the back button shows off your new togs to your peers. If you live by the sea, that is. that sack personages, as they gad about the Imagosphere, all wear a poker face because they're concentrating on the task in hand. Well, it doesn't have to be like that all the time, you know. You can change your expressions using the directional buttons. It's easy. Press up to show us your winning smile. Down brings out a frown. Right brings out your cross face whilst left makes you look scared. You can nod and shake your head by waving your controller around and even switch to control of your hips by clicking the left stick. Get a wiggle on, why don't you? As if that wasn't enough, try pressing the limb buttons and using the left stick and right stick. Look, you're waving. Yes, very good. I'm waving back. Really, I am. Honest. It's... It's, it's embarrassing now. Stop it. Now, I know you're eager to get stuck into all this, but please remember the ethos of the Imagosphere. Create and share and above all, have fun. And you know, there's... Yes, 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 yes. Thanks for that, old man. I'll take it from here. Oh, what luck. There's my little chum to be, ready to come and help me sort out Bunker. Just a simple press of this button, and our adventure will begin. Ah, oh, no. So, one on the left. No, but if, if I'm facing it, then that would be on the. Oh. That's the one!
Holmes. It worked. You're here. Sorry for the rough ride, old chap. My name's Newton. Welcome to Bunkum Chummy Chum Chum, where the sky is strewn with circling clouds of imagination, all ceaselessly pumped into Bunkum's atmosphere by the pounding creative heart at its core, a magnificent moon of wonder. But I'm afraid Bunkum's destiny lies in our hands. Let me explain. Long ago, before the Negativitron nearly laid waste a craft world, three gluttonous gargoyles gorged on Buncombe's bountiful creativity. Inspiration dried up. We teetered on the brink of the abyss. And then, three heroes came. With their speed, with their power, with their grace, Finally managed to capture the Titans. Buncombe restored to the creative paradise you see around you, the heroes retired to the pages of myth. A myth that also foretells of the return of the Titans. Tonight, just before bedtime, all of Buncombe's nightmares become real. And that's where I. I mean, we come in. Join me, my noble assistant. Buncombe's very future depends on we two brave heroes. Let's get down off this mountain. I've got a prezi for you. Oh, how I love the mountain air. It's just so... airy. Press up and down on the left stick to move in and out of the screen. on the left stick and press the action button to jump down a step. If you jump in front of a step, you'll automatically shift backwards onto it. Did I ever tell you about the time I got stuck in a hat? I did? Well, it's a true story and still relevant today, as the danger of getting stuck in Little Big Planet is as real as it ever was. If you find yourself in an impassable crevice or an insurmountable rut, your poppet holds the key to your salvation. Open it with your menu button and highlight the retry option using your left stick. Then simply hold the action button until your little stitched chum pops himself senseless. Don't worry, he'll be back in a jiffy, spat out of that last checkpoint you ran past. Good as new. Did I ever tell you about the time I got stuck in a hat? I did? Well, it's a true story and still relevant today, as the danger of getting stuck in Little Big Planet is as real as it ever was. If you find yourself in an impassable cre... Layer launchers spring you from front to back, that's it! Bounce in and out like a... like a... um... uh... uh bouncing in and out thing. Excellent work. Your bounding nose, no bound. Use the action button to trigger blue layer launchers. Use the grab button to climb along a climbable surface. You can still jump while you're climbing. Just press the action button. The 
awful work. I knew you could do it. Spongy bits and the left stick to drag them about. Tap the action button while dragging or pushing to give yourself a little oomph. Dangly thing and use the left stick to swing across. Retire to my airship to prepare for your, uh, I mean, our death defying mission.
Welcome to my airborne laboratory. My father made it, of course, but I made some refinements of my own. Look at us, co-conspirators, primed for our first top-secret mission briefing. Here, take this sticker. That is our first target, a loathsome locale called Stitcher Manor. Stick it up on the mission board. In the real world, slapping stickers on anything and everything is frowned upon. Rightly so. Have you ever tried peeling a sticker off a cat? Susan was not amused. However, in the world of Little Big Planet, we like to do things differently. Yes, that means you're free to stick Within those whatever walls you want. Looks a your cranky old bag named Nana Pud. Put her face up there if you can stomach it. But we must brave her horrors and make our way up onto the roof. One last sticker. Place it down there, if you would. That is our true goal. The tin that houses the evil titans. We must reach it before Nana Pud releases them. The old bag. Fortunately, I've handcrafted something for just this occasion. Going down. Imagination made mechanical. Handheld inspiration. It sucks. It blows. It is the Pumpinator. This was working yesterday. Now, just pick it up and I can show you how useful it is. You can't have too many pockets. This is precisely why I want to introduce you to the all new... Such an amazing device. Oh, if only Daddy were here to witness it. You can aim it in different directions using the right stick. Point it at that pinwheel and press the R1 button to blow it into motion.
The scholars of the Omniverse have forever debated what the most satisfying feelings in existence are. They used to say batting a hot-boiled egg with a willow cricket bat was the nicest. Then Little Big Planet came along and they said placing a sticker down was the best. Hurry up, dear chum! Nana Pud won't wait if we dilly-dally! see it times two like that, it means you need to bring a friend. Actually, you can bring up to three friends if you like. The more, the merrier. Switches and we'll be on our way. Super Vertical Infiltration Station. And to Stitcher Manor we go! Victory for health and safety, but a thrilling ride nonetheless. This old chum is Stitcher Manor, the final resting place of those dreaded titans. Nana Pud, the crazy crone who lives here, I suspect to be the prophetic liberator of those diabolical denizens. That means she's going to release them. You must get up there and stop her. Me? Oh, well, I've got eggs to boil. But rest assured, I'll be right behind you. Well, not right behind you. Give you a bit of space, obviously. But safely behind you. Pip, pip.
time to pop by. Have a nice trip. for it now.
Hello, Monzy. Mutie. I might have known this was something to do with you. You can't trust a word this boy says. He's tricked you. And he was such a lovely baby. Oh, come on, Mumsy. It's time they were released. Imagine what we can do with all that creativity. Never. Don't you remember what your father said? You must never, ever... you done leading my Newty astray? Poor Newty. He never done no one no harm. He don't know no better. You got to save him from himself. And on the way, you'll save Buncombe too. Come on, follow me. You can't defeat the Titans by yourself. You. I've seen more muscle on a jelly deal. You'll need to awaken Buncombe's old heroes. Hot sock, toggle, and swoop. It won't be easy, but your quest begins in Manglewood, Buncombe's great swamp. Thank you. 